Okay, it's Saturday, uh, Thanksgiving weekend, uh, day after Black Friday. Uh, these are my pickups uh, for today, and everything I bought was uh, purchased at the Meadowlands today. Um, besides these two, these two things right here, there are all together four sales and the Meadowlands. Uh, three of them are estate. One wasn't run. The, the one of them I probably should have went to early because I probably could have gotten some games there. But um, surprisingly, I did find games at the Meadowlands. I didn't find anything. Like, people are going to cream over or whatever. Um, but overall, they were decent deals. Um, I think I'll just go through uh, uh, the games first and then just finish up with the rest of the stuff. Okay. This started out in a tray, and the guy was like $2 a piece. So I'm like, okay. So I, he said, and if you buy a bunch, I'll give you a deal. So I said, okay. So I took three, and I said, would you go three for five? He says, yes. And I gave him a 10. And he said, well, uh, I don't have change. So I was like calling my wife. I said, hey, you know what? How about I take a few more? And then, uh, and then you just give them to me for uh, uh, like a buck a piece, right? And he's like, why don't you just take them all for 10? So I said, great, okay. And I think I got to go through early, uh, through this quickly because it might be drizzling. So here we go. Uh, for $10, I got a Tekken 2, uh, Metal Gear Solid 2, PlayStation 2, um, Holiday Demo Disc 2004. I don't know what that is. Uh, SimCity 2000, a Quake 2, Rebel Assault 2, Spec Ops. Stealth Patrol, Spec Ops, Ranger Elite, Spec Ops, Cover Assault, and a PlayStation looks like a demo disc. Uh, PlayStation, IHRA, Soviet Strike, uh, Missile Command, it's cold here. Uh, Knockout Kings 2000, uh, most of these games don't really have any value, um, but whatever. Here's another PlayStation uh, demo disc, here's a chess, here's an action bass, uh, Holiday 2005, hey, how are you? Um, and a Another demo disc, and this is a Rainbow Six. So that, that was like $10. I mean, how could I pass out that deal? Um, the second good deal I got, and it wasn't, I mean, it's, I'm not really bragging on this, but the guy wanted 80 for everything you see here, and I'll go through it in a second. And I looked at it, and most of the games are BS. I don't even sell PS game, PS2 games too well. So I went through and I said, well, I'd go 50. And we nego he, he said, I'd take 60, and that's it. So I said, fine, right? So here it is, uh, what I got for $60, and it wasn't early, it was later in the day, I don't know if the guy just put it out, um, I don't know if most of the other game guys buying games there don't give a crap about PlayStation 2, but I can sell this stuff. Like, basically, there's a PlayStation 2 system there, and there's a few Dragon Ball Z Budokai games, and I think I can get my money back on just that. Uh, so here we go, here's a loose disc, um, loose discs, and then I'll do the rest of it. Um, Dragon Ball Z, uh, Budokai, and I hope they work. Uh, here's the Dragon Ball Z sagas. Uh, Budokai Tenkachi 2. Oh, another Budokai Tenkachi 2. I thought there was a 3. Alright. Okay. Um, Mortal Kombat. That's weird that there's two of those. I don't think it's a double disc game. Uh, I Toy Bullshit Game. Um, MX Unleashed. Mortal Kombat. Uh, Shaolin Can Kings. These I put in a book, and I sell them for like $4, 2 for 7 3 for 10 Ratchet. Clank up your arsenal, which is funny. Jack 2 and Jacks. Okay, and then I got some games I like Shaolin Showdown. I don't know. I, I've never had that one. X Men Next Dimension, Guitar Hero 2, Worthless, uh, Nano Breaker. Have never had that one. Madden 07, Worthless, Call of Duty, uh, Finest Hour, Not Easy to Sell, Wolverine's Revenge, Madden 2005, Robots. See, I thought there was a, a Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3 here. So I'll have to see. I was going to lot them, but maybe I'll sell them individually. Uh, War of the Monsters. Haven't had that one. Don't know what it's worth. Shrek 2, Stitch Experiment 626. I never see this game, um, but I imagine it is not valuable. Legend of the Dragoon. Don't know. Never had it. Track 2, Enter the Matrix. I had a million times. Very hard to sell. Dance Dance. Uh, anything Dance Dance Revolution Extreme are hard to sell. I will probably just give these games straight to my friend, and maybe he'll sell, if I give him an eye toy, he'll sell them with an eye toy or something. Um, tie 2, or I'll lot them. I'm thinking of lotting PlayStation 2 games because they don't sell too well for me. Um, the Tasmanian Tiger, Bush Rescue, Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas, uh, Cat in a Hat, uh, Crash. I can sell craft, Crash games, even though they don't sell for much. Uh, Grand Theft Auto. See, I, I think the people who had looked at this lot for $80 would be like, nah, it's just too hard to sell. Um, but I know I could get at least 35 for the, that in a couple of games. And, and then those Dragon Ball Z should cover the rest, even though I thought there was a Dragon Ball Z 3, and I think that's the $30 one. Don't know anyway. Soccer Mania. Cool Borders 2001, Hulk, Batman Rise of Sinzu, 
Uh, let me snick it. Uh, these games I can't sell. They're just they're gonna wind up in a bucket that I'll just I might just lot them put them on eBay. Magnum six, two K uh, six. Um, here's the PS2, pretty good condition, most likely works. The guy says it was his. Um, got a dink in the corner, I don't care. Um, it came with this box. To me, the box is ugly, it's beat up. I'm going to give it straight to my friend. I, I consider that no value. Um, and here's the parts for the PS2. You can see there's like little drops on something. So it's, it must be raining. Um, okay, I got a GameCube. Uh, it's a Spider-Man. This is Spider-Man 2. It's not even complete, but this is probably an $8 game. Eight to ten dollar game. I paid two dollars. I paid a dollar for this. It's missing this. I don't care. I can replace that very easily. Um, then I got this for three dollars. I'll buy these for three dollars because I have to order them, and I could probably get them for two fifty if I buy ten of them. But I'm not due to buy some for now, and I need one anyway. Um, here's a. Okay, let me do the records, and then I'll do. Um, and then I'll do jury. I went to a sale, and they had records left. And I think the reason they had record left is because this person, Miles, put his. A, a sticker on every single record. You know what? Let me do that in a second. This is the other. For $5, this would conclude all the games I got. For $5, I got these controllers. This controller has a big crack in it. Um, this will probably work. And maybe it'll work with a Sega one. I don't know. Um, okay, here's the records I got. Who Are You? The Clash. Um, I took this Rocky Horror Picture Show. See, I've got to see if I can peel up this tape. I want to try a combination of uh, gently peeling and lighter fluid. Maybe Miles, but I don't, um, this is Rolling Stone. Uh, again, Miles. Um, this is the Some Girls album, a pretty cool album to have. And since I only paid a buck a piece for these, I am not going to lose money. And the records look reasonably clean. Uh, Ramones, End of the Century. Uh, never heard of the special, so for a buck, who cares? Um, again, another Ramones. Ramones, I almost never find the records. Everybody loves the Ramones. Uh, cramps, never heard of them, and another Ramon. So that takes care of the records I got. Um, I think I'm almost done with everything. Let me just put this on top. Um, got this contemporary signed art glass paperweight. They had 20. I said 10 is all I'll do. It's nice. I don't really love it. Uh, if it was more than 10, I would have said no. This uh, was my only mistake today, and it's it's a really nice file. It was two dollars, but I did not see the handle that I damaged there. So it, you know, there's a chunk missing out of it. I probably will put it away and never do anything with it. You know, I'll use it for a prop or something or whatever. I think my wife paid 22 for this jewelry. This is, uh, it's signed and it begins with a, hold on. Goldette. This is a Goldette. I can't, I can't find the name, but it's Goldette. Um, this looks like Goldette style. She likes things that look like this. Um, four leaf clover. Lucky she likes cameos. Here's a uh, earring and pin set and this final pin $22 for everything and uh, that's it that covers everything I got today